A sadness at the disparity. There is a sadness in the heart of man that binds him to the heart of every other man. A sadness at the disparity and emptiness we feel when we think of all the wars we have marched ourselves off into. It is like a cello playing slowly in the morning sunlight. The rays creeping between wisps of snow rising from the fires of biscuits and coffee. The hours will languish, but the strains will wear on. Claiming the protection of the softer and gentler nature of our humanity, we have told ourselves this violence we allow and the unbridled passion for killing, for belief, is to be expected. War is a consequence of our duality and our compromise. From here, it looks like all tendons and muscles, all bloodied and torn, they tell me we must do this, or else we'll fail. And yet this hollow and aching presence in my center does not feel good, but it ties me to all other men, at this time and through all time. And I'm not sure how to honor this, this aching and horrific sense of my participation in some dark and ill thing that we are all doing against the deeper part of our will. And yet... And yet again, as I see them come up and over that small bluff with their steel shining and glinting in the early morning light of day, I know that if I long to see my dear and helpless child again, my lovely and fair wife, I must drag myself and my mixed emotion into that battle bridge.